Hi friends, Molly from Spoke here to welcome you to another installment of our Getting Started with Spoke demo series. In this video, we'll cover creating mood boards. Mood boards are Spoke's way of sharing your vision and setting the vibe for your projects. Let's dig in. Create a new mood board in a new existing project by clicking Create a Visi in the design section of your project and selecting Create Mood Board Visi from the dropdown. From here, you can choose one of the easy to use templates Spoke has created or upload your own background image. You can add inspiration images to create a vibe board or use product collage to create a shoppable product roundup. For this training, let's use a spoke vibe board plus palette template to cover all of our bases. Once you've selected your template, you'll see that there's a text box that explains how to use it. Let's work through that. Start by selecting any image in the mood board. You'll see the edit toolbar come up across the top and you'll see the replace option, which you can use to swap the existing image with a new one. Search using keywords or use the filter options to filter by color or spoke sign. I'm looking for some inspo images with red and I'm a Lyra spoke sign, so I'll filter for those and see what spoke has handpicked based on my sign. Click on the image you want to add and it will replace your selected image in your mood board. You can also upload your own image using the replace function. Click the plus icon and then click upload image. From here, you can easily add an image from anywhere on the internet by going to the image right click and choose copy image address from the menu. Jump back into Spoke and paste your link in the image URL field. Name the image and then click upload. If the image you've added has a background that you want to remove, you can do that by clicking background in the edit toolbar and then clicking magic. You can then scale or change the image in any way you like. If you're building a product roundup or want to include product info in your mood board, you can do that using our product section. Use a combo of available filters for things like brand and category and keywords to search for the name of the product you're looking for. Once you've found it, add the product and then quickly remove the background if you want by clicking the three dots on the item and then magic background erase for a shortcut to our background eraser. If you can't find the product you're looking for, no worries. Copy the URL of the product website and then use our quick add shortcut to import products with ease. Check all the product details and then make any adjustments to the product in your mood board that you want. Next, let's replace the color palette in this mood board to fit the vibe. Click color palette in the left navigation bar. If you haven't created any color palettes yet, we can create a new one by clicking plus and then selecting create from scratch to let Spoke pull colors out of any image. You can create a color palette based on a whole visi or just using one of your inspo images. I'm going to create this one based on the inspo art I added to this mood board. Move things around and remove any colors that don't fit your vibe. You can also add new colors if you want until the color palette looks exactly how you want. Once it's perfect, give your color palette a name and then use Command S to save it. After that, head back to your mood board to update the color palette. Use the replace function and then rotate and stretch until it's just right. Now that you know your way around the tool, delete the instructional text box and rinse and repeat all the steps we learned until you've completed your mood board and successfully set the vibe. Use the share function to share your mood board to socials or download it as a JPEG or PDF. If you haven't yet, check out our room visit and floor planner demos to dig into bringing this vibe to life in your space.